this video, we will be going over to the SEO tab in Big Data Analytics and discussing how you can use the information you find here to better understand your site's revenue, keywords, and rankings. Here, you can see what queries are driving the most revenue. In this example, Whoop versus Fitbit followed by Whoop Strap BJJ. Both generate over $5 EPMV. You could use this information to write more content on comparable topics. You can also look at your keywords and consider what the consolidation of risk is in certain queries or keywords. This way, you can diversify the nature of some of your keywords or ensure that one type of query doesn't account for the majority of all your keywords. For example, if a high-ranking query for this site is BJJ events near me, during something like a pandemic when events are not happening, this query would become obsolete. Using this report, the publisher could see that the majority of their high-ranking search queries had to do with BJJ events and try to diversify to avoid this. This report can also be used to measure the cost or profit of algorithm updates that Google announces. There may be queries that I originally ranked for that I no longer rank well for, or that EPMV has dropped due to the update. Looking at this report can then be used to justify spending on SEO tools or strategies if you were hit especially hard. Additionally, we can determine the return on investment of time spent optimizing an article and increasing its rankings. We can do this by looking at time periods before and after working on an article to improve ranking and see what the profit is.